grab it here. So we have a look at a simple temperature controlled switch. So let's get into it. So anyway, here's the, uh, the switch that I kind of like to use. These are simple bimetal switches. So that means that there's um, two contacts basically with um, different metals, and, um, and based on the temperature, they they move in a different way, and then um, that creates a switch moment. So there's no electronics involved, and you don't need a power supply for it. So there's a simple lead in and a lead out. Uh, this is uh, can handle up to 250 volts, um, five amps, and it's um, rated for 45 um, Celsius. So the way I usually use this is I, I use them to um, switch on and off fans. So um, we have the um, little bit of plus voltage for the fan, and then it goes through the switch. And then it ends up in the in the fan. And in this case, I just have a for demonstration purpose. I have the small fan, but you can actually have more than one fan. With, you know, different voltages and stuff. So the switch doesn't really care. So I thought what we do is we um, heat up the um, this, the switch here and see what happens. So oh, now you see the fan started, and that triggers at 45 degrees. And the nice thing about these switches is that they're a bit slow, so um, they won't switch off immediately when they're, um, you know, because of the this packaging is takes a while to cool down. So you get this kind of you get this very nice delay action on the switching off when it's being cooled down. Which I think is exactly what one would like to have with with fans. So one wouldn't want the fans to be going on and off, on off, on off. One wants to have a little bit of a delay in um, both directions. So now when I cool it down, then you see the fan stops. So that's a simple temperature. And these are these come with very many different temperature ratings and um, uh, you know amperage ratings. But I'll put the um, the information about this specific type in the comments. So I hope you found this informative, um, please consider subscribing, hit the like button, it was worth it, um, merch is available, or if you'd just like to buy me a cup of coffee, it would help the channel um, get more components in. Um, links are in the comments, and um, I'll see you in the next one.